Conce number two coming up, Paul. All right, in Conce number two, it looks like the uh, pole sitter is going to be Tomek Kowalczyk uh, with the Dad's Appliance Repair 27. He is out of Glen. Bob Coons outside the front row at the Pitts Motor Service 29. He is from Mechanicville. Row two on the inside is going to be the uh, number 97C. That is going to be the nice and easy 97. Uh, Corky Warner out of Johnstown, and then on the outside, Loudon Reimer with the number 12A out of Only, Pennsylvania, the Jumper Jacks Pro Speed Car. And then you're going to have uh, Garrett Poland inside row three with the number 17, and it'll be uh, Dave Weiss outside with the 77. David Schilling with the 20S and the 91 of the Ginger Ninja Jack Leonard are going to be in row number four. Row number five is going to be the straight number 12 and the hatch number 18. And then finally, the two Whitbecks, Thomas on the inside, Shannon on the outside, in the final row. So second consolation race, 12 laps, top two are going to move on to the Sunflower 50 race for a cause. We are green. Kowalczyk jumps out to the early advantage. Corky Warner trying to fight it out here for the number two spot. One car into the bales on the back stretch. That is the uh, Dave Weiss number 77 making contact with the bales and getting his flowers. He'll jump around and join up at the back of the field. Up and Corky Warner going around here under caution. He'll be able to get that car turned around, get his spot back. But he's got to get out and get it over the uh, lip of the banking here. Piece of debris laying on the racing surface here in turn number four. That's a pipe and it's a little warm. So Corky will cycle back around, back into his respectful starting position. The white flag will wave. No laps complete yet in this second consolation race. We're staying under yellow for the moment. David Schilling sliding in in the number six spot. The two 405s going to line up next to each other. All right, ready for a restart here in consolation number two. The field goes a little bit early, but green flag will wave and it will stay. No, it will not. Yellow will come out. So we'll try to start one more time. A little bit early on the acceleration there for Tomek Kowalczyk. He will lead the field down here for the restart. Here we go green. Bob Coons trying to slot into the number two position here on the takeoff lap. Reimer up to third, Schilling into fourth. Corky Warner rounding out the top five as one of the whipback carts is battling him for that spot. They are hot and heavy in the middle of the pack. Meanwhile, at the front of the field, it is still Kowalczyk holding on to the lead, and the yellow flag will wave. There was trouble for the number 71. Claire will have to tag up at the back of the field. As I'll go ahead and double back up, we have one lap complete. One T off the pace a little bit here as well. That is uh, Bonnie I'm driving the number one T. Of course, member of the uh, Fonda Speedway safety team. So Kowalczyk and Koontz continue to hold on to the two qualifying spots here from the front row with one lap complete in the second consolation race as they get ready to come back off turn number four. We're back to green. Oh, 
Now look at the outside move by Schilling. That moves him up into the number four spot. Meanwhile, Reimer slides down to the inside of Bob Coons, takes over that runner-up position. One car sideways, that's Weiss. Jams up everybody from about six spot on back. That allows the top six to break away on their own. With three laps complete, Kowalczyk leads. Reimer second, Schilling knocking at the door from the number three spot as they work their way away from the 29 of Bob Coons. They've separated from him by about three or four card lengths. Whitbeck battling it out with Warner now as they go around turn three and four. Lap number five complete. They're catching up to Bonnie Russ at the back of the field. Bonnie will go ahead and pull that down into the infield. Grass and your leader spins it off turn number four. Well, Kowalczyk goes from penthouse to outhouse in the blink of an eye and what was a pretty tight battle at the front of the field with Loudon Reimer. And David Schilling, Schilling now inherits the final transfer spot. Coons is third. Looks like Corky Warner is right there behind him. And then you've got one of the wetback cards up in the mix there as well. And also coming back up through... There we go, getting everybody into line. We'll go green next time by. So Reimer now leads, Schilling in second on this restart, one lap shy of the halfway point in the second consolation race. Field back off turn number four, back to the green. Reimer will lead him down into turns one and two. Coons will try to jump to the inside of Schilling. Schilling will come down to shut the door on him, and Whitbeck will slide through on Coons. Move up into the number three spot with the purple 405. Watch for David Weiss, too, trying to do work on the outside lane. Oh, he gets tangled up with the Trump 2024 car, and we are going to have a multi-car incident. Bringing out the caution here in turn number four. And it looks like Kowalczyk may be all done with the number 27. They're going to go ahead and take that car down into the infield. He started leading this, but couldn't survive all those early restarts. So six laps of the 12 are complete in this second consolation event. Halfway through in this second consolation race, it's still Reimert and Schilling leading the field. And checking something on the back of the Weiss, number 77. And unfortunately, it looks like a mechanical is going to take him out of contention to qualify for tonight's Sunflower 50 race for a cause to benefit VCHC. And now it looks like Corky Warner having trouble with the number 97 over here at the entrance to turn number two as he had a hand up in the air. Apparently lost fire on the cart. Trying to get it restarted. Looks like Bonnie Russ is going to take the uh, 1T pit side here as well. And Warner climbing up and out of the cart. And it looks like, unfortunately, his race is going to be done as well. So a little bit of attrition here under this lap six caution flag. As we get ready to come to the green, six down, six remain. 
Reimert will lead it through turns one and two. Here comes Witt back to the inside on Schilling, taking away that final transfer spot. Schilling fights his way back down ahead of Coons, back down to the bottom of the racetrack off turn number two. And watches the purple 405 of Whitbeck directly in front of him. Now in that last transfer spot with only about three and a half laps to go. Schilling trying to knock, knock, knock and open that door. Whitbeck trying to keep it shut with two laps left to go. Loudon Reimert holding on to the lead with the number 12A machine. As he comes around, he'll see the two to go signal this time. Whitbeck still in that second position with Schilling trying to get back into that transfer spot with the white flag waving this time. Reimer brings it off turn number two. He's going to now work off turn number four to grab the win, and it will be Whitbeck who will hold on for the final transfer spot. So Reimert and the purple Whitbeck 405 are the two cars that will move on into tonight's Sunflower 50. So the heats and the consolation races are now complete. We'll find out who has provisionals. We'll find out about buy-ins. That will set the remainder of the starting field for tonight's 50-lap Sunflower 50 Race for a Cause, which will be coming up here in just a few minutes. Again, we want to say a big thanks to some of our uh, great sponsors, including DKM Fabrication and JK Signworks for all their help. Again, thanks to the Murphy family and H&M Equipment for that awesome flyover at the start of the program this evening. And, of course, a thanks to Empire Hay. Not only do they do... Uh, hay bales small or big like the ones that we have this year the big ones but they also do custom plowing and custom planting no job is too small and there might only be one or two jobs that are too big for them so get in touch with the gang from empire hay next time you're looking for plowing planting or paying as the case may be all right so a little break in the action here folks while we get the uh, drivers ready for Driver introductions for our Sunflower 50 Race for a Cause. Our feature presentation will be coming up in just a little bit. 